Hello, and welcome to another Let's Play by me, The Game Rule 6 of Shogun Total War. On the last Let's Play, we got a few more bits of land, and also sent a whole bunch of, you know, soldiers to attack the enemy, a lot of them to their deaths. Because, you know... When we lose battles, even though we have twice the amount of men, we tend to lose three times the amount of men. That ain't fun. But hey, at least it makes more money so that we can have, like, build more units and whatnot. Eh, yeah, heckin'. Oh well. At least, yeah, it doesn't seem to be too aggressive, which is weird. Like, it, early on, if you, like, have an unguarded province, even if it's just an ally looking at it, they will probably attack. And right now, while I don't have unguarded provinces, because that would be stupid and, you know, we have tons of men, they're just kind of weakened, uh... Yeah, it does seem to be a lot more reluctant in attacking. Why? I don't know. There isn't a defensive bonus. But, whatever the case, send more men. Uh, yeah. Let's see if that will work. Emphasis on C. Are you gonna treat, or are you gonna do something, or what? I'm tired of having my daimyo retreat, because that's just l lack of honor. We have that many men. Finally, Jesus. God, look how much men we lost. Hey, we took that place. Noise. And hey, we don't have to worry about that place. It reduced the amount of surface area. <laughs> Neat. Uh, you guys go over there just to protect that flank. Something. Oh yeah, you guys. Um, go there. We should probably reorganize you guys a bunch. So I guess next targets would be these areas, because after that one big army, there's a lot less armies to army. Uh, but we should probably call in reinforcements. It's weird that they don't have... Well, I guess we might have accidentally burned it down. It is weird how often, like buildings seem to go down in this game, but I guess in this game, and maybe the next game, it's like, hey, they really don't want you to expand too fast, because, you know, rebels appearing out of nowhere, even though it, you would have, like, no taxes at all, and stuff like that. So they don't want you to walk in on a place and see how much, like, nice farmland and high-tech recruitment buildings they have. So yeah, right now the game is kind of a war of attrition. Me sending thousands of men, mostly to their death, and killing a couple of their guys along the way. Bugger. I really wish it didn't do that. Can you just put it to adjacent, dude? Bugger. Oh, go away, Portuguese. We don't want your guns or Christianity. I guess we'll just wait here till like loyalty shit happens and then go to the next area. Yeah. And we could also build armies and whatnot. We'll just have to see when it's like. It's gonna fall. Or maybe, like, two seasons or turns before it falls, and then we move a whole bunch of guys over. Okay. Because it'll be, like, one season here, next season it falls, so... Yeah, I guess. Could always use more dudes. 
Oh, whoops. Yeah, I played a little bit of, like, Medieval Total War. Not Medieval 2, but Medieval Total War. Like, I was playing it kind of like on my own thing, and... Boy, it really does do the thing of Medieval 2, where it's like... Somebody attacks you, you fight back, the Pope's like, knock that shit off, person that was attacked. It's like, really? Oh, it also said, you need, you need to stop fighting the French and also give the French back their land. Which, like, unless there's some kind of historical thing that uh, it didn't tell me about or something. Um, it, I didn't take any of French's lands, it took my lands. buggers. So I don't know what adversaries are supposed to do in this game. Like, I guess they can also... Yeah, I think they can bribe dudes. <laughs> oh, I think when it says one season, it's... Yeah, it says about to fall. Yeah, yeah well. Let's move all these dudes over. Okay, next turn. Okay, they have one big army there. That's pretty much all I know. Hey, we're rich. And last time I knew we had the biggest armies. Oh, we have to wait another turn? Okay. Sure. Uh, does anything need to be built? I mean, that could be built. How about here? Nope. There? No. There? No. 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 Yeah. Maybe. Cool. And hey, we got fuck tons of money. Noise. Yeah, I guess we put everybody together and go attack those jerks. I mean, we did attack them in the first place, so I guess we would be the jerks, but still. Hopefully they're not going to revolt. Wow, that is a fuck ton of loyalty. Can you kill him? You know, because reasons. I just don't like the cut of the jib. Yeah. You're doing that. Does the assassin still assassinate them? Hmm. Oh, they're there. I guess. Yeah, let's just wait. You know? Let's we'll just see how many turns it takes. Nice. Not nice. Legendary farmland destroyed motherfucker. At least it was just downgraded instead of completely destroyed. I don't know if that's of any importance, really. Since, you know, that probably happened at some point. 
Oh wait, can you just... Oh, cool. That saves us a bunch of time. Well, I wouldn't want to be in a battle, like, being a foot soldier in one of my armies. Especially in this game. Because I'm being particularly, like, Soviet Union with my men. Okay. Oh, what was that one World War II game where, like, it had that intro that was like, Oh, this shit's different, where... It's like you're in a boat and there's this guy yelling at you like to f go and fight the Germans and people are dying around you and you don't have any weapons and when you get to the front line you're given a handful of bullets. No gun, just a handful of bullets and it's like, oh shit. And it's like, there's some, some of the allies are treating and they're getting shot by like the officers of, the Russian officers and then you meet a guy that's like, hey, um, if we go back, we're dead, and if you move forward stupidly, we're dead, so how about, or I guess if you move forward, you're dead, so how about, you know, you kind of distract the um, Russian, like, officers while I put a bullet in their head so that, you know, we can get from point A to point B without dying, which... Was one hell of an, like, thing. Being like, ooh. Need to make sure I don't die. That's important. And our own guys are attacking us. Alright, shift. Cool. So many dudes. Uh, I guess we could just send them over and save us all time. Except for like one group. Yeah, no. Then, I don't know. Uh, yeah, you're good. I don't think they can use that port, so we should be good. Oh, they have a place to retreat to. Hmm. We'll have you get yours. And have a little bit of backup. Sending most of these dudes south and having... Okay, I guess that's not your son. Uh, doing the attackings. building shit. Yeah, you guys go there. they're doing a strategic retreat. A.K.A. keep on running, building up all the armies that uh, we can get until things improve. Yeah, sit and wait. Nah. Hmm. 
think it's just it. Wait, watch. Oh, not those dot guys. He's dead. I find it funny that he just pokes him with a sword. Like, if I was that dude, I would, you know, run him through with the sword, because, you know, that definitely makes sure he's dead or not. Because he would go, ow, I'm being stabbed. And B, that would make him even more you know, deaded. So, yay. Sure, just keep on retreating. Not like I care. I guess I should tell my guys to make more men. I don't remember doing that. Uh, ooh. You guys got that. Ooh, and you got Battlefield Ninjas. Jeez, you guys are busy. Mass producing sword saints. Uh, too bad I can't get the intro for this game. Or the, hey, you won victory, here's this interesting thing. Because it basically is like, and this person built this castle. And then, oh, here's the future, aka modern day. And here's the statue of the daimyo in some part of Japan. Because, shit dog, this guy was very important in shaping Japan. He must produce a whole bunch of men and sent them wave after wave of them at the enemy. And that's where that one guy who made Futurama got the idea for Zap Brannigan. And for those of you who do not know who that character is, he's a general who, I guess, gets shit done? But he's a complete incompetent buffoon, which only, like, a bunch of the main characters know. Because they deal with them periodically. A.K.A. the one thing where it's like, and I sent wave after wave of men at them until they could, the enemy couldn't fight anymore. <sighs> so I basically like what I'm doing right now. I do not have enough money to build that sometimes. It looks like they're itching for a fight. We got five times, four times the men. <laughs> and we lost about the same amount. Now, what are you gonna do? Which one was one low? We should really try and combine a bunch of these dudes. Oh, but you guys got the Sword Saints. How do we give the Sword Saints the Daimyo? You know? How many do you need? Three. Who get the cool dudes with the swords? The people from, like, America will try to imitate. It was interesting, like, watching a video of, like, here's a bunch of students swing their sword at, um, a 
bunch of bamboo and then like the teacher comes out swings it like they do decently well not great but decently well then the teacher comes out swings his sword and then like he cuts through all of them like butter can't believe he killed his students like that uh, bamboo They really want to take that place. Wait, it didn't say somebody was retreating or was it them? Maybe. I don't know. Pro possibly. Yeah, you got boats there. I guess we could send people in the northern areas. Yeah. So we could build an army to attack that place and we won't have to worry about so many other dudes. You go over there. I don't think I could think of why it would be like, hey, you can only build one thing at a time. It's like, hey, you only have so many builders in a province to do shit. Which sucks. I, I liked it a lot better in what Empire Total War when like you can just build as many you can build all the buildings at the same time. The only problem is you can just you know skip the earlier levels and go straight to the higher level shit. You have to you know work your way up there. Like it would be kind of better if you could just skip all the way up there, but, like, it would take a penalty of... Maybe it's cheaper, but, like, between when it's on the first level and when it's on, like, up to when it's fully built, it would, um... It wouldn't be able to do anything, or it wouldn't have, like, the benefits from first tier to the last tier. It would still be, have first tier, no, tier no. shit until it gets... You know, to the later tier stuff. Or until it gets to, like, the max level and whatnot. You know, you know what I'm saying? Probably not. I don't know. Uh, and that guy to help do the hey, are gonna attack shit. Or, yeah, yeah, an enemy doesn't seem to really want to attack, usually. Buggers. We had sword saints. Just make sure everybody's recruiting. Yeah, let's get Yari Cavalry. Okay. Portuguese. What happens if we do that? I don't know. Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh no, not my Jenna woes. My Jenna woes. Nice. Does that mean we're at war with them? It looks like we're sieging them. Nice. <sighs> we should probably bring dudes over. So that they can protect that one region which doesn't have a lot of dudes right now. Uh, there. We're actually there. Makes it easier to move shit. Hey, more sword seeds. Heck. Now my dynamo. Damn you. I'm gonna send him over there. Kind of espionage. Yeah, you do that. Okay, that's starting to piss me off. Ninja, get over there. Counter Spaj. Sure. In the depths of the ocean. Yeah, something about water. Actually, don't need that. Probably should make sure everything that's building money stuff is building money stuff. Okay, you're doing that. Before we end this, and make sure that places that are building dudes are like getting them better shit. Especially since better equipped dudes don't cost more. It's just different, like, different units. Nice. Oh, we're already doing that. Okay. And then I guess we combine all these dudes and send them over. Mm. Oh, you guys got that too. Nice. Uh, so, I guess we're gonna have to end it here. Not another Let's Play. At least we got, like, more, like, lands, so we can make more dudes, and they have less lands and shit, so they can't make some more dudes, or as many. Wars of attrition. So, yeah. Please comment, because I like comments. Tell me what you like, dislike, tips, tricks, otherwise. How are we gonna do this? That does nothing. Doing this does nothing. Doing that does nothing. That doesn't do anything. It even increases the surface area. I'm just gonna have to get lots of dudes and cover a whole bunch of places. We should probably focus on the places that don't change our surface area. Uh, yeah, comment, because I like comments. I had the hiccups there. 
Don't you like, dislike, tips, tricks, otherwise, if you like my YouTube and would like to see it grow, a whole bunch of people are going to die over there and it's probably going to be our dudes. Please like, subscribe, and check out other videos to help my YouTube grow. And please remember to spay and or neuter your animals to help control the pet population. And until next time, on a Let's Play by me, Game of 6 of Shogun Total War. As soon as I move everybody over and then tell them to build more of them so we could send more of them to their deaths. Yeah, I'll tell them it's honor so that they'll just run for it. I mean, that's what most military is. Yeah, either that or I'm going to kill you if you don't kill those guys or attempt to kill those guys or at least be cannon fodder for better units. War sucks. I mean, it makes good movies and shit, but it, you know, it sucks to be in it. Damn it, I didn't bi go and say, hey, build buildings for all the places that are making units. Ball me. Mm. Ooh, look at that. Make monk warriors. Uh, it is kind of funny that, like, in the beginning, I'm doing it well, and then now I'm just, like, being brute force, send wave after wave of men at the enemy. Hope. Oh, I know that we're able to build more men than they are. Like, if we have enough money in a turn, we can make an entire column of dudes. Maybe not the best equipped dudes, because they're like, what? Step up beyond peasants with sticks? But still, better than nothing. Decent cannon fodder. Makes me go, oh, we lost all these men. Bugger. Okay, that's all that. So yeah, thank you all for watching, and see ya.